as a doctor on a lot of trips, people come up to me all the time and they go, you know, I've got a little diarrhea. I need some medicine. And I will just say, you know, how, how little is your diarrhea and what's really going on? And to me, the kind of diarrhea that I worry about is invasive bacterial diarrhea, so-called dysentery. What does dysentery mean? Even doctors that use the term hardly know what it means. It means that these organisms have invaded the bowel wall and these people look and act sick. They feel miserable. A friend of mine said, I felt like I was going to die and I was afraid I wouldn't. So what do you treat that with? That kind of diarrhea requires antibiotics. The person that goes, you know, I think my stool is a little loose and it's been like that for a few days, I'm not sure. That kind of person I have other plans for. But the person that comes to me and says, ah, you know, I feel terrible. They often have tenesmus, muscular cramping in their gut. They uh, may have bloody or pussy stool. Although, whenever they mention that as a, as a sign in a medical textbook, I'm always thinking, like, who sees that? How often do you go, oh, there's some pus. It's pretty hard to notice when you have explosive watery diarrhea. I think the hallmark of the diagnosis, people that look sick, often low-grade fever, belly ache, and they have explosive watery diarrhea. And if you say, when did it start? They don't go, you know, I think I've had it for about a day and a half, maybe two. They go, you know, this morning at 9 a.m., I just had this massive explosive episode of diarrhea and that's when it started and now I feel horrible.